Srinivas BV, a name frequently being tagged on Twitter by those desperate for help in COVID cases. Today, one request stands out. A three-year-old is gasping for breath in North Delhi's Narela. Immediately, he and his team get on to the task of loading an oxygen concentrator and thus begins a race against time. Meanwhile, an assurance has been sent out. Srinivas informs the family and posts a tweet saying, Tell Ayansh that we are coming with much needed help. It has taken over one hour to cover the 40 kilometers and to hand the device over and then explain how it is operated. When the team reaches here, the child's O2 level is at 83 on the oximeter. The child's father, Alok Kumar, a university professor, is COVID positive and is grateful for the help. His son is vulnerable as he has had multiple immunity disorders. I want to say that for the human being, it is a very big service. And in the same way, they are doing it. I mean, I don't get a parallel in Delhi. I'm seeing it in hundreds of places. I have called phone in the party offices, here and there. But the help or the help I can get here. Many lives like these are helped every day through Srinivas and his team. Even smaller needs are taken care of. Hundreds of these home isolation kits are also given out to patients, which carry basic medication. बहुत सारा patients जो home isolate हैं, वो लोग के doctor से request आते हैं। तो हमारा भी दो-तीन doctor हमने जो youth congress का doctor है, वो लोग उनसे बात करते हैं। इसमें हमने एक mask है और sanitizer है, cough syrup है, vitamin C, vitamin D है। जो पैरासिटामॉल है, जो डॉक्टर ने इन लोग के लिए लिखा है, जो वो मेडिसन हमने वो मेडिसिनेशन के लिए उनको देता है। The 39-year-old youth leader was a wicketkeeper batsman and represented Karnataka in under-19 cricket. His playing career was cut short when he hurt his eye during a match in 2003, and three years later he joined the youth congress. In 2010 he shifted base from Bengaluru to Delhi. When the pandemic struck in 2020, he strengthened his position in the Congress High Command's eyes by setting up a network of Youth Congress volunteers under SOS IYC. Rahul Gandhi was so impressed by him that he appointed Srinivas as the Youth Congress National President. As part of the IYC initiative, Srinivas has overseen the setting up of COVID control rooms in all states, with the main one being in Delhi. ये कम से कम ये सारे लड़के लोग बैठे ये कम से कम 16-17 घंटे काम करते हैं नॉनस्टॉप ऐसे ही देख के हमने क्या क्या बता दे कोई हम भी भगवान से प्रेय करते हैं जल्दी ये किसी के घर पे ऐसा आस्था ना हो जाए बट क्या कर सकते हैं हम बहुत लोगों को मदद करना चाहते हैं बट हमारा पास उतना रिसोर्स नहीं है या मौका म but जो इसका भी हमने जो request भी इतना हाथा है, हमने कोशिश करते हैं जल्दी से जल्दी कितने लोगों को मदद। हम और एक महीने हम सोने के लिए तैयार नहीं। But it's not just common people who are reaching out to him, even embassies did, which led to this snub by the foreign minister himself. But Shrinivas says these things don't stop him. देखे हम सड़क पे अमर आपको के सामने लोग मर रहे हुए देख रहे हैं उनका दुख को देखे हम के अंदर दुख को बर्दाश्त नहीं कर पा रहे हैं कौन क्या कह रहा है कौन क्या बोल रहे हैं हम उसपे ध्यान नहीं देते हैं अरे भारत का संस्कृति है परंपरा है कोई मेहमान आता है उनको सेवा करना उनको क्याल रखना at a time when there is public anger over how the government and all systems failed in providing even basic resources, these heroes have emerged as a ray of hope and continue to serve the people day and night. In New Delhi with camera person Sushil Rati, this is Sukirti Devedi for NDTV.